photographer, uh, ambassador, I guess that's what people are calling it or something, but it's, you know, kind of just a, a lifestyle of, of, what I, of I, what I do, you know, riding motorcycles and finding old parts and just bolting them up on crappy old Harleys and Triumphs and riding them down the road. Um, not really an artist, but I guess you put something together in your own eyes, it's kind of your own form of art, but uh, I don't know, so that's, that's what I do and that's who I am. When I was five years old, I remember Christmas morning, like my dad came, you know, came in and then like in the garage, you go in the garage and he had uh, a Suzuki JR50 like mini bike, dirt bike. And I mean, it was like the best Christmas ever still, you know, and, and I remember that morning like riding it. You know, he opens the garage, I'm all stoked, little kid, like riding it. Yeah, and he's running next to me, like crashed into a rose bush, hit the curb, flew over the bars. <laughs> he kind of put, put, you know, put the stuff in front of us and we just kind of grabbed onto it. With motorcycles, there's no real rules. You can, you know, choppers and stuff is just do whatever you want, you know, and, you know, like strap the skateboard to the motorcycle, go to the skate park, and that's what we were doing. And people were just kind of like stoked on it. And we kind of, you know, people were like asking about like, oh, this or that, or what, you know, what's your, what do you, you guys, is this what, you know, they, people were picking up on what we were doing, and we kind of just came up with this goofy name, like Cycle Zombies, you know, like it was kind of, You'd find a bike that was broken and it was all crusty and dead and stuff. And it was, you know, you'd be at the at a, at a swap meter in some guy's backyard and you find this crusty old bike that hasn't been started in 30 years. And then you tear it apart and you get that thing running again. And it's 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 cool because you, it's it's kind of like you're bringing that dead, you know, back to life. And that's kind of I guess the I guess that's kind of the meaning with cycle zombies is you know like bringing like old junk back to life.
of a smile on your face Held on to the love in a crazy state of grace Warm myself in the phantom of your Old stuff kind of made, it just stoked me out and it was rad writing. And then you think like what they would do back in the day and then you're writing it now but pushing the limits, you know what I mean? And you know, whatever it is, like if you're riding an old chopper and banging a wheelie on it or you know, riding a, a single fin old whatever, Dewey Weber surfboard, like solid tubes or something, you know, it's just kind of pushing the limit. So we just, it was like, that's what we called it, cycle zombies, you know, and it was, don't, we didn't really care what people said or thought and just do what we wanted to do and build our style of bikes and, and it just kind of like, you know, like it was a family thing, you know, and, and I think people were stoked to see like, kind of like, like a brotherhood thing of like just, you know, a lot of people have had that relationship with either their dad or uncle or whatever and they're like, they're stoked on that part of it and just, it's the same for any of us, like you see a little kid on a skateboard and he's like, got some turd skateboard that's no good. It's like, it's cool to like hook him up with something and you know, it's like put him in the right path of doing rad stuff. So, yeah.